First tonight at 6 as the fall semester winds down, local students are missing class as their buildings have become the target of school threats. So we wanted to know how school leaders are balancing keeping kids safe with keeping them in class. KSHB 41 News reporter Mackenzie Nelson examines the most recent threat. Several students at Bishop Ward High School were picked up early by their parents after the school was the most recent target of a threat. We did have some parents come and, and take their kids home, which is their right. President of Bishop Ward, Jay Dunlap, told KSHB 41 that a social media post was brought to his attention. There are some social media posts, Instagram, uh, and some of our, our students saw the messages and, and took screenshots and informed us and we're very grateful that the students did the responsible thing and let us know. According to a letter sent to parents, Bishop Ward along with Wyandotte, Harmon and Schlegel High Schools were named in the post that threatened gunfire at dismissal on Tuesday. We just feel that we need to take things seriously and so we're doing our best to do that and we've informed our parents and our community what the situation is and, and we'll keep them updated if any additional information comes available. Threats made against Bishop Ward High School aren't the only in the Kansas City metro area. Over the last week, we've seen a handful of threats against other local high schools. Last week, Blue Springs South dealt with a similar threat and over the weekend, Wyandotte was informed of one which kept over half of the student body home from school on Monday. A district spokesperson says only 900 students out of 1,900 were in attendance. Like other schools, Bishop Ward is taking additional safety precautions by having KCK police at the school. Thanks be to God, most threats are idle threats, but you can't take them that way anymore, right? You have to deal with them seriously, and that's what we've been trying to do. It's unclear if KCK PD will be on the school's campus later this week. In KCK, Mackenzie Nelson, KSHB 41 News.